So I'm filming this the same night as the night I uploaded the Can You Guess What The Engine's For video. Um, I got the engine in front of me. It's on the other side of the shop. That's why I was walking around the truck. I didn't want to give it away. So I'm going to pan the camera up and everybody can see the disappointment of their wrong guesses. Any final guesses to what that's for? That is a 1941 Farmall H engine ready to run. All it needs is a carburetor and a distributor and of course put in the tractor. Um, I bought it for that tractor you see sitting right there. This tractor was my way out of a crappy purchase of mine. I bought a old International 1310 truck, uh, dump truck, and I wanted to get rid of it. And my way out was a partial trade. Trade the truck plus some cash for this tractor. And the tractor run good for as good as the engine was um i pulled the plow with it for a little bit and the plugs kept uh getting built up with uh burnt oil it burnt oil like crazy uh wet stacked and it had a bad knock uh the engine in it the I believe i gotta think here's the engine all tore apart that was in it. It's either cylinder one or four. I believe it's cylinder four because I think they go cylinder one's at the back of the engine and cylinder four's at the front. I think. Don't quote me on that. But the it spun the rod bearings on the crank and was knocking god awful. So it needed a new crank and it needed a new rod and thinking about it now I probably could have just got the crank and the rod and had everything remachined but I wanted to rebuild the whole engine completely everything while I was rebuilding the engine and I just I don't have the time right now to do it uh, I'm not that sharp on all the machining work that needs to be done to rebuild the engine um, so I kind of did it as like a learning process but right now I'd love to see the tractor back in action mm -hmm. so I had this engine I seen it for sale a while ago I said ah, I don't need the engine I got an engine and this one set it run come out of a good running tractor I seen a video of it running in the tractor and uh, everything so last night I was thinking about it I said, you know, it's going to cost me about $1,500 plus to get that engine rebuilt over there. And this one was for sale for $400. Um, the guy wanted $400 for it without the manifold, the carburetor, the governor, and the distributor. Well, I offered him $750, and he said, give me $7... Or, I offered him $350, and... He said, well, give me 375 I said, all right. So he took the carburetor off and the distributor. He left the governor and the manifold on it. So I got a few extra goodies with it. I didn't need any of that. I got all that other stuff over there. But I needed the water pump and a clutch. It's got a good clutch on it, I think. He said it was a good clutch. And the oil pan's got a big ding in it. So I'm going to put my oil pan on it. Um, I have to repaint the tractor because this engine's got more paint than the whole tractor's got on it all together. Uh, let's see, anything else I can think of about it. We put it in the back of my grandpa's truck because I borrowed his truck today to pull his four-wheeler down there and put it on the pallet and all the oil started leaking out of the breather tube all over the bed of my grandpa's new truck. 
I had oil all over everything. It dripped down the tailgate onto the bumper, got all over the front of his trailer, all over his four-wheeler. It was a mess. But I got it cleaned up, and the engine's here, so that's all that matters. So with this video being made and me getting the engine for the truck, that'll start a little series I'll make about putting the tractor back together and hopefully get it back together and running maybe this coming week or so. Depends on what all I have to do. I gotta clean the shop. It's a mess because that tractor's gonna go right here under these lights and everything. So, whoever the winners are, or winner, or whatever, I'll get their head out to them if anybody guesses correctly. Uh, I didn't make any direct video on that tractor, but I did mention it a couple times. I'm guessing, since I'm making this video before I even post the other one, I'm guessing a lot of people probably said the combine or the truck over there, because I talked about doing engine swapping it. Um, some people might even said the other truck sitting behind the farm all. It's got an engine in it. It's keeping its engine. Um, so I did that because I figured it would probably be a little bit harder of a guess to guess that tractor. Which may be a little mean on my part, but it's all in good fun. So hopefully you guessed right, and thanks for watching.